So happy Easter Sunday. I hope everyone has. And uh, hopefully we'll be chatting with you week after. Check some oil. Oh, it's down a tiny bit, but still in operating range. Just about ready to do for a change. And uh, get the summer oil in. This big boy is the old uh, 7 3. She rattles, makes a little noise, but she's been pretty reliable. The old girl's got 360,000. Keep the oil changed regular and hopefully it will uh, last me for another couple of hundred or so. This should be bare. It was pretty much covered in snow two days ago. Over the winter, I don't plow it all. I just drag it, pack it down. Now it's draining away. So it just, uh, you can see how it chews up when you gotta go through it. You know, two wheel drive, you could get stuck, but let it go on. So. Enjoy the weekend. Well, it was all going good, and then it happened. So, now, I got a problem. We gotta tear a whole bunch of stuff apart. I got a broken e-brake cable. So, I'll try and show you if we can, I don't know light here but better try and replace it that's got to come apart so Full of dirt. Why wouldn't he want to wash the truck before he did that? <laughs> huh? All that down in your face. Come here. No, oh, how'd it go? Unhook this. That's going to take. No. Oh. That's out. out through the germ grommet up there through the floor so all side cutters I guess will cut off what we have to see if we can get the new one in oh holy smokes man a new cable what if it's not in the right spot oh. Looks, uh, it looks all right. I just got to twist it around up here. Uh, come on. Put it where the other one laid and... Oh. <clears throat> yeah. Can I screw with it down here or is it going to buggy you up? Nope. 
good. So, guys, this is change an emergency brake cable. It is much easier with two people. Oh, if you have a second to hand me that clip while I'm laying here. Okay, I got it. Oh, I had it. Guys, this is just show you a little bit of what goes on. You can't afford to take your vehicle to a mechanic shop. You try to do what you can yourself. Smash my finger. Okay, that's in there. And we just gotta get it up to there. So, got some things to put together inside though first. All this stuff has to come out and this whole big power box has to come out. I can twist up in there easier than I can. There I got ratchet straps hooked up. I got them as tight, tight as I can pulling that emergency. Like eighth of an inch. Well, let me just see if I can. I think it just a. Go. Uh, oh wait, that's good. Good, hold it. As tight as, uh, these <laughs> hmm. little straps supposed to be good for a 500 pound pull. Well, I got my feet braced and that's all I can pull on them. They are singing tight. I'm playing my guitar back here. Maybe I should just release it all and then tighten it again. Maybe it'll shake some rust out. to connect that new cable to the old cable under here so that's what we're trying to do now that way down in there bolts got to boat that hole that whole mechanism back together and the power I am pretty sure it started, but way down in there behind the breaker panels, but I can't show you. I need both hands and I gotta shut this off, so. Just it and we'll, a couple other little clips and we'll have her back together. Well. Oh. She's back together. Back together. Oh, that emergency brake is tight. Hopefully it'll work. <laughs>